Are you a coach or a healer looking to generate more leads for your business? Well, if that's the case, then this video is for you. We all win when we all win. We all win when we all win. Hey there, my friend. I'm Super Sid, the Marketing Shaman, and I help coaches and healers create their first or their next 10K payday where they go out there and generate $10,000 for their coaching or their healing business in 30 days or less using a profitable presentation. And in today's video, we're specifically going to be talking about all things leads. What is a lead? How do you generate leads? And specifically, how do you find people who need your help and who are wanting to get your help through the solution that you provide in your coaching or your healing business and are ready to pay you money to get that help right now. We're going to be talking about exactly what a lead is. We're going to be talking about the best places to find your leads. And ultimately, we're going to be giving you some of our best strategies and how we generate leads every single day for our coaching businesses here and what we give to our clients as well. So I'm super excited to uh, go over this stuff with you and I'm super excited to show you how getting leads is actually a lot easier than you think. Without any further ado, let's head in to this video. So first things first, what is a lead? Like what does it mean when you get a lead for your coaching business? And a lead is a term that we use in business and that coaches and healers use in business that refers to someone who is interested in your coaching services or coaching packages. And ultimately they're a lead because they showed interest or raised their hand in saying that they were interested in wanting to talk to you or ultimately learn more about signing up for your coaching packages. So now that we know what a lead is, let's go over the difference between a good lead and a bad lead. Yes, not all leads that you get for your coaching or your healing business are going to be the same. There's going to be ones that are good and there's going to be ones that are not so good. But what, what really defines the difference and what makes a lead a good lead and one that's not so good of a lead? Well, ultimately, right, when you have a coaching business, you're solving someone's problem. You're helping them get to a goal or a target that they want to get to that either, in their, you know, usually in their life right of some kind and ultimately right when you're d defining a good lead versus a bad lead the first thing we want to look at is is we're not going to be able to work with everybody right like one of the things i tell our clients is that generalists get slaughtered but it's the specialists that get paid so ultimately we want to make sure that we are seen as a specialist in the marketplace and as a specialist to the people who see us to help them solve their problems because ultimately right those specialists are going to be seen as people who get paid more money to help solve a specific problem that they have so one of the things we really want to make sure that we identify is what are the qualifications that someone has to be someone that could work with us, right? If we're someone that's working with, say, divorced people or people who recently got divorced, it wouldn't make sense that someone who is happily married is going to reach out to you. If you're only working with women, it wouldn't make sense that you would ever reach out and try to sell someone who is not a woman, right? Or a man or whatever, right? So ultimately, right, we want to make sure that we understand what are those at least basic qualifications so that we can make sure that we are meeting people who ultimately really could use our help with solving a problem. And through getting our help to solve that problem, we'll usually be able to solve that problem a lot faster. Before we go into the next segment of this video, I want to remind you to subscribe to this channel. I'm putting out new and exciting videos every single day showing coaches and healers so they can go out there and they can create a 10K payday. Specifically, go out there and generate $10,000 for their coaching or their healing business in 30 days or less using a profitable presentation. Make sure to click that button below and subscribe. Quality over quantity. Yes, in the lead generation game, when it comes to generating leads for your business, I think a lot of coaches and healers and just a lot of people in general, they look at that number. How many leads did I generate? Instead of looking at the number of how many leads did I turn into clients, <laughs> right? And for whatever reason, we look at these generating leads as kind of this pump up number. Yeah, right? Like I just generated thousands of leads for my business. But then they don't, you know, the question never really gets answered of, well, how many of those leads did you actually turn into paying clients? And then even on top of that one, how many of those paying clients actually, you know, got impact from you, actually were influenced by you and actually were able to go and reach the thing that you promised them, right? Those numbers are more important to me than how many leads I generated. So ultimately, right, when, it, when we look at lead generation, we look at wanting to generate leads for our business, I'd much rather, you know, worry about the quality of leads that I'm getting than the quantity, right, of leads that I'm getting. Because if I'm getting better leads and the quality of leads is better that I'm getting, guess what, right? Those leads are typically going to close faster. They're typically going to pay us money faster. And ultimately, you're usually going to do that spending a lot less time with us because since they're a qualified lead, a lot of times they're already going to know, right, the problem that they have. They're already going to know the solution that they're coming to you for is something that could help them. And because they're already qualified, you're going to spend a lot less time educating them about what it is that you have and a lot more time actually helping them get to the goal they came to get your help for. 
All right, now let's talk about setting up your organic marketing machine where you can go out online and you can set up a marketing machine that is gonna feed you clients daily. And what you're looking to do is, is there's obviously a lot of social media and a lot of you know different websites and things like that out there where you can put content right or you know ways you know basically communicate to people who have problems that you can help them with the solution that you have you know you have facebook you have instagram you have linkedin you have youtube what you're on right now you know you got podcast right you got tiktok you got clubhouse it's so it seems like every couple of months there's a new social media that comes out right and you're like oh my gosh like i can barely keep up with one how in the world can i keep up with another 50. So ultimately, right, when it comes to this thing, instead of adding on more, we actually need to simplify it. And it doesn't start with where we want to start um, online. It actually starts with where our customers are at. So one of my mentors, his name was Dan Kennedy, actually came up with something called the marketing triangle. And what the marketing triangle talks about is where your message, so what you're communicating to people, right, has to match right an audience of people or has you know basically you know has to match a marketplace so your message has to match a marketplace or an audience of people and then you have to meet that audience of people right on a media platform so that media platform might be facebook might be instagram might be linkedin but ultimately all three of those have to match and if they don't match then then ultimately right your marketing is going to fall short and some of you might be experiencing that right now that are watching this video and the way we want to make sure that we can resolve that is when we're building this machine going over the couple things that i'm I'm going to go over with you when starting that machine is ultimately right we want to make sure that we are going to the social media or the places that our customers are at if nobody is going to if nobody is going to instagram to get help with you know your thing why are you going to go talk on instagram no one's over there no one cares maybe they're on facebook or you know i think a lot of people they'll automatically go to facebook when tiktok might you know tiktok is hot so tiktok might you know might be the thing to, you know where to be at we got customers right now who are in the makeup industry, who are in like, you know, very feminine industries as well. And like, you're like, y'all, like your avatar is on TikTok going, it's going TikTok, right? So I think at the end of the day, you know, you're the, the, the marketing and the content that you're creating, it's all the same. Like if you go over to Facebook and you watch me do it and you see me do a video or a workshop over the exact things that I'm talking about now, that content does not change. If you go over to TikTok, you'll see shorter videos, maybe breaking down different things that we're talking about in this video, but that content doesn't change. It's just the way that it gets delivered changes, whereas like TikTok 60 second videos, whereas YouTube is typically you can post longer videos and shorter videos, right? And then understanding which type of content um, that that you know, platform likes and is gonna help you promote your business. So the first thing we wanna do is identify where are our people at? Where is our audience at? Now, once we identify that, there's a couple things that we want to set up. The first thing is what we call a profile funnel. So that's where you're going to be setting up your profile for success so that when people visit your, you know, your profile on that platform, they're specifically going to know who you are, what you do, and specifically know where they can take the next step to start getting your help. So like here on YouTube, if you go check out our page or our channel, you're going to notice at the top, we have a banner on the, bo on the bottom right side of that banner. We're um, sending you to get one of our freebies that we talked about, which is our profitable presentation pack. You know, stuff like that, right? And you're gonna, you know, you go into our about in our description, it's gonna let you know who we are. It's gonna have links in there for you. If you go to the description of our videos, it has links, it sends you places and stuff like that. Um, by the way, you can go check those out right now, right? But ultimately, you know, at the end of the day, right? Like we're gonna have our profile set up to where when you come and visit the channel, we're just gonna have basically our world out there for you to go and explore. Now, a lot of people are gonna start out on Facebook and the Facebook profile really came, a profile funnel really came from Facebook. And that's really when you're going out there and you're setting up stuff like your cover image, your description, your profile image, and your pinned post in a way that is gonna be pointing people to a lead magnet or pointing people to a group or pointing people to where they can start getting your help, right? In ours, we actually point people to a Facebook group or point people to a workshop that a lot of times happens to be in a Facebook group, right? Um, or to a profitable presentation that we're running. Um, but ultimately, that's kind of something that you're gonna to wanna to set up. We have other videos on our channel that really break down that profile funnel for you. And you can definitely go check those um, out. We'll have them some here, somewhere here on the channel where you can go check those out. And then um, the next thing I really wanna to talk to you about is what we call our friend request tag. Now this is powerful and you can use it anywhere. Now it really works well on things like TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, those types of things. And this is where someone is going to wanna to connect with you on that platform. So if you're on Facebook, right, and someone wants to send you a friend request, 
Well, if we have a profile funnel set up in a way that's letting people know who we are, what we do, and it's basically set up like a banner, and they send us a friend request, to me, I look at that as a lead. So ultimately, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna reach back out to them and I'm gonna drive them down a sales conversation, which is ultimately gonna drive them into either getting on a call with me, coming to our next profile presentation, getting into our Facebook group, whatever it might be, so that they can ultimately be added onto our list as someone who is, you know, aiming at wanting to get our help and we can start nurturing that lead and ultimately start, you know, turning them into a paying client down the road. So ultimately that's kind of what we're looking to do. Now you can do this on Instagram for people who follow you, TikTok for people who follow you, YouTube for people who subscribe. I mean there's a lot of different ways that you can do that friend request hack. But ultimately, just the motion of doing it and doing it every single day is really going to help you get connected to a lot more people and ultimately help you point those people into the direction of starting to get more of your help. Are you a coach or a healer who's looking to go out there and make more money? Maybe you're looking for better ways to convert those leads that you're generating into paying clients. Well, if that's the case, I just got done with what I just got done with the brand new what I call the perfect profitable presentation pack. And what the perfect profitable presentation pack is is going to be everything that you need to go out there and build your perfect profitable presentation that you can go out there and use at virtual events every single week to go out there and sign up multiple new clients for your coaching or your healing business every single week on the way to reaching your first or your next 10K payday where you generate $10,000 for your coaching or your healing business in 30 days or less. It's absolutely free and you can grab it down there in the description right now um, for free and I can't wait to see you on the inside. But don't forget, we all win when we all win. Let's go out there and let's make a choice to win today, not only by subscribing to this channel, but by going down there into the description and grabbing your free, perfect, profitable presentation pack right now. We'll see you in the next video.